Hey, what is up, guys? Happy TGIF. It is Friday, and I'm bringing you my first triple battle upload against uh, Q or uh, Pile Driver from AA uh, or Ever Asylums, AAX. Um, so uh, he leads off with his full Intimidate team, a Dunsparce, uh, Arbok, and a Hitmon top, and I have my Nido King, Swamper, and Carrot top. So he goes to the, for the fake out right off the back on my uh, Swamper, and I go for the Earth Power on his Arbok, which is super effective, and uh, he lives it with like. 20 HP, and I go for the hidden power. I don't know what hidden power I have, so I just wait for hidden power, whatever, on his hitmon top, and it does nothing. So he goes for the rage with his Dunsparce on my Swamper, and then he goes for, uh, was that beat up or me first? I think it might be beat up with self conscious or whatever from his Arbok, and you know, it's getting its stat boosts and shit. Hold on a second. Take a sip of some water. Okay, um, so yeah, this is going on. Um, Thing is though, uh, I didn't know like uh, when I did this battle, like pinch berries were illegal, like tire bear and all that. I've seen people use tire berry a few times, so it's just like, oh okay. So my uh, my carrot top, my flame, my fire ape has uh, a tire berry on it. So we'll get to that later. So you know that gets all done, and you know now everyone's chewing on their lefties. It's like oh nom nom yeah. Uh, so uh, well, except for Arbok, he's he's an asshole because he has black sludge. So um. He switches out his Hitmon top and he sends out his Bar or Barjuana or whatever it goes for. Okay, Arbot goes for Protect and then um, I go for the Wide Guard. And I'm kind of glad that I did do this because, like, I didn't put it, I put it on this. I made Swampert pretty much to be Triple Battle Center. So I went for the Wide Guard, which was great because Dunsparce went for the Rock Slide, which was awesome. So that worked out perfectly. So my Fire Ape goes for the. Um, goes for the focus blast on his Dunsparce and that easily takes it out which was great so um yeah white guard with uh, my swamper it's fucking fantastic so um black sludge lefties and then he brings in gold duck which has cloud nine and then I switch out my Nido King and bring in my Gigi Giro as his gold duck goes for aqua jet and Gigi Giro takes it like a champ so um his uh I guess he Barwana goes for Sucker Punch on my Carrot Top as I go for. Oh, wait, no. Who went for Sucker Punch then? I have no idea. Someone went for Sucker Punch on my thing. And I went for Solar Beam, and then he went for Brave Bird, and then activated my ability Gluttony, and I ate my Pataya Berry, so I'm boosted now. And uh, I went for. Yeah. That, that was pretty much it. I think, I'm, I think I'm totally lost here. Let's catch up on this turn. So everyone's getting lefties and Black Sludge. So, I go for Wide Guard, just because Swampert's at full HP, no one's hit him, so, you know, that's cool. So, I go for Solar Beam on his Gold Duck. I'm not sure why I didn't go for the Aqua Jet on my, um, my Fire Ape, but, you know, I guess that's how it goes. So, Solar Beam takes that out. Gear change out Giga Giro, so that's awesome. My speed and my attack are, like, awesome now. So, his, uh, Barwana goes for Roost, even though it's, like, you know, it's pretty much an okay... Pretty much, I, got, I don't know, whatever. So he goes for Switcheroo on Arbok and gives me Black Sludge, and I give him Le while I'll be taking damage from Black Sludge instead of gaining HP from leftovers. So, you know, that's cool, I guess. Uh, just because nobody seems to be wanting to hit my my um, Swampert. So, you know, I guess that's how it goes. So he brings in his Hitmon top, and uh, Giga Hero has clear body, intimidates Swampert, and intimidates uh, Carrot Top. So it doesn't really matter. So he switches out his uh, Arbok and brings in his uh, Murkrow, and uh, him on top goes for the fake out on my um, Carrot Top. As I go for Wide Guard again, because I don't really have anything to like. It has Earthquake and uh, Ice Beam, but you know it's, it's whatever. And uh, Mud Sport. So he goes for Faint Attack on Carrot Top, and it doesn't kill me. So you know, I guess that's how it works. And he set up a tail. I think he no wait no he switched. He's gonna set up a tailwind this turn with his uh, Murkrow after I take damage from Black Sludge. Yeah, he goes for the tailwind, and you know everyone's speed is like super awesome now. So he goes for the Mach Punch on my Carrot Top, and it kills it, and it's dead. Okay, which is cool. So I go for Gear Saucer on his Murkrow, and I I get crit, which really didn't matter because I went for Ice Beam. On Murkrow also, because I thought he was going to be a Confuse Ray and be a little haxy little Murkrow like mine. So he switches his Varwana into the middle, and it takes the Ice Beam instead of his Hitmon top. So, you know, hooray, that works out for me. You know, that's awesome. So, um, his, there, he gets lefties, and I get Black Sludge, I'm like, Rrr. so he brings back in his, uh, uh, 
Arbok and you know gets the intimidate off on you know my other uh, just just Swamper this time and I go for wide guard again just to be you know lulzy and um, he goes for the mock punch on my Swamper and it does nothing he goes for soccer punch on Kiki Giro does nothing and then I go for gear saucer on his uh, Barwana and it does a good amount of damage it brings it down almost red pretty much almost red so I go for sledge bond on him on top just to be just to be me so he goes for the psych up which uh, copied my um Giga Giru stats which you know makes his attack and speed a little better but and then plus he has, also has tailwind so you know I guess that's working out well for him okay so you know the longest part of the match man these triple battles those leftovers and all that shit like end of game items it's like alright so everyone's got leftovers so he goes for mock punch on Nido King does absolute shit and then um, he goes for Sucker Punch on Gigi Gear, does absolute shit. And then uh, he goes for Brave Bird on my Nido King, and it does a lot of damage. It almost kills me. So he takes a lot of recoil damage. As I go for Gear Saucer on Arbok just to kill it, and that thing dies and it's fabulous. And then uh, I go for a Sludge Bomb on Hit on Top, and I get a crit. And I guess it did kind of matter. I don't know, because his hit on top look wasn't looking like it was doing anything to any of my pups. I go for Ice Beam just to end the match on his Barwana, and it dies. And that was uh, GGQ, or uh, Power Driver, or... If anyone who knows who I'm talking about, and you've seen him, and you know his channel, or you sub to him, please uh, post the link in the comment uh, box below, telling me his YouTube channel so I can link it, because as you're about to see, I have a picture of Q right here, and... Um, from Third Strike, and I'm just gonna, you know, do the little spotlight link, at, like I always, like I've been doing in my videos a few times, and I'll just link it to his channel. So, um, yeah, if someone knows what his YouTube channel is, or just, you know, comment that, or, you know, private message me so I can link that, you know. Um, also, I guess that was pretty much it. You know, you can check out last week, or uh, last, the latest up, or the video that was before this, a singles battle, which I had against Tornado, uh, Survives, which was a really good, it was a pretty good singles match. Um, it turned out I had a miss, uh, I messed up. It was a 2-0, not a 1-0, so I did even worse. He had a Lucario left that he never brought into the, end of the battle, so, you know, you know, there's always that. Um. But yeah, uh, so yeah, that was GG, uh, Q, uh, Pile Driver, or, you know, whatever. Um, it was a fun triple battle, um, so yeah, I guess I'll just end it on that. I uh, hope you guys have a great weekend. Uh, I'll probably have another video. I have a lot of videos I want to upload. I have another one up, um, Sunday. Yeah, probably Sunday. Most likely Sunday. Most likely Sunday. So, you know, you can look forward to that, and I'll catch you guys later. Cheers.